De La Wright, my envies. Welcome. Oh, Lori, um, um, Blow Blow is alleged to have, you know, run out of her family house where she went to. Midnight, she was shouting, Egg by me up! Egg by me up! Egg by me up! Come and help me. Hey, they said it's not small, uh, Rono. They said that she was shouting allegedly from the Amebo headquarters. We heard that she was shouting that the strange artifact was pursuing her left, right, and center. That, that strange arti um, artifact wanted to buy her. That she seen it here, she seen it there. They said Uncle will come now and say, ah, uh ah, -uh, where is it now? It is here. They said they will look, they won't see anything. That um, the um, auntie will come. Look at it there. Look at it. They will look, they will not see anything. Hey, hey, hey. It's not a small something, no. They say any pig that you dig for somebody is going to fall on top of your head. This very pig was dug for Olori Naomi as much as, of course, I don't know if it was also dug for Ashley, but hey, whatever happens, this one, eh, the thing is returning back. Have you heard that thing they say? Back to sender. This is exactly what is going on right now. So they said, uh, you know that on your FIFA, it's alleged to have asked them to go, as in the um, um, Odua Palace, Odua uh, Council men, asked them to go or uh, indefinitely until they bring back Queen Naomi's frame. Frames, okay, that disappeared from the palace. So for reason, for, for, for that reason that uh, they were not sleeping, they were not sleeping in the palace again. So she decided to go to her family house. You know that Lori Runke comes from a royal home also. And of course, they said they are known and they are also very wealthy. So she decided to go to her family house. Now, um, strange artifact that is in the on, in the palace of the Oni of Ife. It does look as if that strange artifact has the ability to disappear and re reappear somewhere else. The last time they checked, it was still in the basement because they have not been able to find out how they can um, uh, uh, expel it or something. They are still investigating. They are still trying to um, do something about it. Now, what we heard was that when she left and went to her family house at night, midnight while she was sleeping, that she saw the strange artifact. And she was so um, uh, enveloped by fear that she started screaming that this thing wants to buy her, that she was running kitty kata kata kitty everywhere. Then she was running and they said people now ran to her, they held her and she was crying that she seen it here, she seen it there, she seen it here, she seen it there. And that was when they automatically found out that she's got something to do with the situation with that um, a very strange artifact. So what is the situation with this? Where did you bring it for? Were you the one that brought it? She said she did not bring it. That from what they said she is saying, you know, that it was artifact that she also bought from um, uh, uh, Benin Republic. And the art artifact was meant for their big Olokun festival as well. Now, you do know that Olokun festival is a festival that the um, Ile Ife people love so much. And the wives of the Oni of Ife, they get to really show themselves at times like that, okay? They get to really show themselves at times like that. Um, so Olokun Festival, you know that the wives to the Oni of Ife, they love this Olokun Festival so much. That's where they showcase their love for their tradition and they ho a whole lot. So usually during Olokun Festival, they say they contribute so much and they buy gift and all of that traditional gift to add to beautify the festival. So this time, from what we are hearing, they decided to go outside, you know, the shores of Nigeria to buy um, um, all of these traditional artifacts and all of that. Now, when you know, during a local festival, I don't know if you have seen it, you see some of these things that look like basket that they carry. They carry a lot of traditional stuff and all of that. They try to beautify it. They, they admire it. It's their culture. It's their tradition, which is all okay for them. So, right now, from what they say she is saying, she said she bought an artifact from um, uh, Benin Republic, okay? And um, 
that she brought it was an innocent act that she never meant to go and buy anything that she would not be able to control that the thing is that they gave her they may have given her something that is bad now the artifact she bought is something that she brought by herself to um um, the palace of the Oni of Ife. And of course, she showed um, everybody what she brought and all of that. But it is looking as though that artifact has something to do with this um, strange artifact that is here. It's like it's a kind of connection. It's looking as though when you pick that one, this one will follow you. You know, this one can fly. This one used to appear and disappear. Like it's a spiritual thing. It's a spiritual being. It looks almost like a deity. But the thing is that they say people don't know where it's coming from. Now, the question is, if I, they, if I priest, they are saying that if this was actually coming from Benin Republic, that um, they would have known what it is because Benin Republic, they have some kind of um, culture that is a little bit um, the same with that of the Yoruba people, that they would have known what it is, but they do not know. But again, you know that the French speaking um, Africans too, they also have a lot of tradition. And maybe they just, maybe, just maybe, they need to really investigate what this is. So, but she said that the first time she saw this uh, being was when she entered the house from Benin Republic public that she saw something that she didn't understand and she cited that thing from her mirror and so and she was very scared but the next time she looked again the thing was no longer there and she saw, thought that was all and you know she didn't see that um, creature again until the day that there was this alarm and everybody was called um, to come and see what they had seen in the ba in the basement that she couldn't bear it, that she cried so much, but she just could not, she didn't understand. She couldn't admit it because she wasn't sure if that thing she they saw now happens to be the same thing she saw that day. Welcome back to my channel. It's you guys, Adela Rama, I bring you fresh and spicy, just from the South still on the Royals. Please bear with me, I am outside again today. Um, how are you guys doing? I appreciate you guys. I love you. Thank you. And share uh, do well, my people. It's not a small something, you know. If you're yet to subscribe, kindly go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And do not forget to turn on the notification bell. And do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Hey, hey, hey. It's not a small something, you know. They say this artifact ran to the owner and the owner was shouting hey bami oh hey bami oh hey bami oh where did you bring it from when they were asking why didn't you admit and all of that this is rumored information no no be me talk i'm not here here i do not live in the palace of the only of ife neither am i related to members of the families of only of ife i am just a blogger when i get a gist i bring it here but i tell you the truth these are all alleged information. Now, they said there is serious tension in the palace. Everything is going really, really wrong. Nobody can understand what is going on again. Right now, the good thing is that um, 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 they, they have been able to find out where this whole drama with the strange object is coming from. Even though it is um, looking, uh, even though the woman is saying that it was not deliberate, she did not just deliberately go to bring it, that she went for something else and they attached something else to what she brought um, to the palace of the Oni of Ife. And everyone is saying, this is the height of it, oh, hi, this is an alleged information, I'm going to bring you more update. I appreciate you so much, thank you.